What would you say to the judge if the judge was asking why you should not be held in contempt and incarcerated for defying a federal court order? withdrawal from Afghanistan that this administration conducted, historically disastrous, I might add, in which 13 American service members were killed, including one from my home state, hundreds, maybe thousands of Americans left behind to the enemy where they still remain. Is it, it's your testimony that rigorous screening and, and vetting has, has occurred. So I assume that you mean by that that at least the standard refugee screening processes, if, if it's rigorous, it's at least the standard refugee screening process. Is that correct? Am I right about that? Um, uh, Senator, I do think it deviates um, from the, um, the refugee screening, but um, we have taken steps to make sure uh, that the program is indeed rigorous. And I Bill Gates has been pushing the idea of tracking people with digital tattoos, and Microsoft was recently granted patent number 060606 for a cryptocurrency surveillance system connected to the human body. Now enter HR 6666 to authorize the Secretary of Health and Human Services to award grants to eligible entities to conduct diagnostic testing for COVID-19 and related activities such as contact tracing through mobile health units and as necessary at individuals' residences and for other purposes. On May 1st of 2020, Illinois Congressman Bobby Rush introduced H.R. 6666. This act is essentially setting up a nationwide contact tracing and quarantine program run by Big Pharma.